So I've been asked several, several times about how long does it take to do your evening chores? What's up, Cock Hill Farm peeps? This is Jason and the Cock Hill family, and today we're gonna show y'all how long it takes us to do evening chores. So I've been asked several, several times about how long does it take to do your evening chores. Well, today we're fixing to find out. And we're talking, we got to feed and water pigs, chickens, ducks, geese, bantams. What else? Um, rabbits. Rabbits. Goats. Goats. We gotta get eggs. We gotta check on some baby chicks. So, I get asked that a lot. How long does it take you? Well, we're fixing to find out. I got my phone right here. We're gonna put a timer on it. We're gonna set a timer up and we're gonna time our evening chores today here on Cog Hill. Right, so we're some chicks, so let's take care of them. Now we got water on. Yeah, let's get the water out. You need me to get it? Yeah. You got it. All right, let's go fill the water up. Can I fill it up? Yeah, fill it out real good. These are, what are these? Uh, yeah, barred uh, rocks? Um, some mixes and some flowers. Barred rocks, her little flower hens. And some mix. And some mixes. Next on the list, goats. Actually, can we do eggs? Let's go get eggs. Don't need to. Not this time of year. They, they are not laying worth the hoot right now. It's just so hot. Go get the Bantam's egg first. Oh, it's a, several Bantam eggs. We love the Bantam eggs. We eat them, you know, just like we do the full size ones. I think two will work for each one. Okay. He sure does have a yellow feet and beak. He does, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. Tony, Tony. Y'all get out of there. For some reason, the top got knocked off. But they've had a field day today. I'll check the top, and you can get check the other ones. None. Just two. Just two eggs today. So hot. The garlic, the garlic is just about ready. Um, it'll probably be ready this weekend. I'll double check it and make sure, but it feels pretty good. We've actually used some of it to make some some hummus with. And um, it was fine, so I'll probably take it down this weekend. Yeah, let's feed the goats next. Yeah, I gotta go fill the hay up. Turn goats waste more hay than they eat. What's up, Skipper Tipper? What's up, Boots and Bo? Goats fed, hay's filled up, tips crazy. Let's go check on the rabbits. Rabbit feed actually looks good, but I'm gonna top it off. Oh, 
This is our silver fox female named Cookie. She's our first rabbit. We've had her for a little while now. We named her Cookie. Reason being is the owners that had her prior gave her one vanilla wafer every day. And we stood through the same thing. She absolutely loves it. Yeah, rabbit's water is good. We don't have to worry about it. Gotta go cut the electric fence off so we can get in there and clean the pig waterers out. Pig, pig! <laughs> While the water is filling up, I've had several people ask me the last few weeks about our pigs, what kind of pigs we raise. And I'm sure they're just new to our channel, but we raise American guinea hogs. It's an old heritage breed that's rare and is starting to make a big comeback. What's great about them is, is they don't get big like a normal pig. They're great for a small homestead or a small farm because you're not battling with a three, 400 pound pig. You know, on average, you're talking about 150, 200 pounds. We keep the males and females separate also another question I get asked about the pigs is, are all our males cut? Uh, all of them but one. We got one breeder that's our main boar goat, and boar goat, our main boar. He's not fixed, but he's in there with all the other males that are fixed. All right, let's go make sure Tipper and company's got water. What's up, Big Daddy? And y'all drink water. What's up, big man? We try to keep kitty pools around here. We clean them out every day. Doesn't look like it, but we keep we try to clean them out every single day. The but ducks the ducks are waiting on it. Yeah, the ducks are waiting on it. Hey, they know we're fixing to clean it out. Walk like an Egyptian. Have we checked the figs today? Let's see. We had one ready yesterday. Mary Carl had it. This one's about to be ready. I'm getting close. Getting close. I need to fill the, the egg layers water up. Mary Carl before we shut it. You're not seeing double. We have two identical black cats. Now I gotta go check on the Cornishes. The Cornishes are out and about eating in the little paddock we got them set up on. And uh, I need to get them inside the coop. So nothing gets them at night. Egg layers done, bantams done, duck ponds done, pigs done, eggs gathered, rabbits done, goats done, and Cornish is done. Let's go check the timer. How long did it take? One hour and eight minutes. Evening chores. Now you know. Now I know. And knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe! Let me show y'all the newest member of the family. Mort, the newborn kitten. What's up, Mort? Hey, Peaches. I appreciate your help tonight. Thank you. I do have a question for y'all. How long do you think it took to do the chores? Mary Carl, how long? Um, an hour. Well, I cheated because I saw the phone going. <laughs> <laughs>
Hey guys, thanks for watching the video today. If you missed our last video, go check it out right over here. And if you're new to the channel and like what you see, hit the subscribe button down below. Y'all be good.